हेलो गुड मॉर्निंग आई एम डॉक्टर पूनम संभाजी एंड टूडेज टॉपिक फॉर द पेरेंट्स विल बी हाउ टू यूज अ थर्मोमीटर दिस इज़ अ वेरी वेरी कॉमन प्रॉब्लम आई फाइंड विद द पेरेंट्स ऑफ माई पेशेंट्स और इवन मेनी अ टाइम्स आई गेट दिस क्वेरीज ऑन माई ऑनलाइन पोर्टल वेर इंस ये थर्मोमीटर कैसे यूज़ करने का इसमें तो नंबर कहीं अलग ही आ रहे हैं वॉट इज फीवर ओके सो आई फर्स्ट थाट ऑफ मेकिंग अ वीडियो अबाउट वाई यू शुड यूज़ अ थर्मोमीटर एंड हाउ यू शुड यूज़ अ थर्मोमीटर ना वॉट आर द टाइप्स ऑफ थर्मोमीटर सो दीज आर द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ थर्मोमीटर वन इज दिस इज अ डिजिटल थर्मोमीटर एंड दिस इज अ इंफ्रा रेड थर्मोमीटर सो द इंफ्रा रेड थर्मोमीटर कैन बी आई द लाइक दिस or it can look like this there are different i have around 4 5 varieties i usually end up using this okay uh, so uh, what happens is uh, uh, these thermometers check the temperature so that you come to know whether your baby is having fever or the baby is not having fever whether you should be giving medicine to the baby or you shouldn't be giving the medicine to the baby okay so what is fever fever is any temperature which is above 99.5 degree fahrenheit or to be to be easy to remember you can say below 100 degree fahrenheit is not a fever above 100 degree fahrenheit is fever in india we usually follow degree fahrenheit uh, there is other system of uh, de- temperature also that is called celsius degree celsius but many parents usually do not follow this okay so uh, what you have to do is the in case of degree celsius Above 37.5 degree is fever. Below that is not fever. So easily you can remember as about 38 is fever. Okay. So now how do you use this thermometer? So this is a digital thermometer. Okay. I usually prefer digital thermometer of these two types. I do not prefer the regular traditional thermometer of that glass with the mercury because it has happened many a times that the baby has picked up the thermometer and thrown the thermometer then uh, thermometer has broken and the mercury has come out so i usually do not prefer that so digital thermometer is fair enough this will come within below 200 rupees it's quite cheap quite affordable and you know you can just use another one if one goes bad uh, one goes faulty okay now how do you use so this thermometer has to be first put on you can see these numbers here this is in degree fahrenheit presently once it is on you just put it in the underarm without the clothes okay within the upper under so underarm should be without the clothes and just hold it straight in line with the body now why in line with the body because this way you'll be able to hold the baby okay so just put this and hold the hug the baby so that the thermometer remains inside baby doesn't even recognize that there is a thermometer inside why not jutting in front let is i'll show you after some time now this is another thermometer just for a demo purpose now why not put it this way because baby will just remove it give it in your hand now thermometer is beeping okay can you hear that yes okay so now that means there is temperature is recorded now what it shows is uh, 96.5 okay which is 96.5 which is normal hmm? now the other way is i never put it this way because baby will remove it throw it out or give it in your hand they are quite smart okay the other way out is put it this way okay so that again you can hold the baby hug the baby snugly and the thermometer remains behind baby can't reach it like this baby can't reach it this way neither can the baby reach this way okay so once the thermometer reaches then you check the temperature now there are many parents when they buy thermometer they realize are i put on the thermometer instead of degree fahrenheit it's showing degree celsius how do i change because i don't know degree celsius okay so many a times i get calls doctor yeah this shows some different temperature it's every showing only 36 37 it is showing in degree celsius so i have made another video wherein i have showed how to change degree celsius to degree fahrenheit and degree fahrenheit to degree celsius the vice versa so that description that uh, link i will give in the description box below so this is about the thermometer digital thermometer now coming to the infrared thermometer now about the digital thermometer it checks the temperature of the skin directly in direct contact okay now about the infrared thermometer it checks the uh, heat that is emitted by our body 
okay so it will sense that way that's why it is the infrared thermometer then now this thermo most of the thermometers will come with two uh, two options one is the skin temperature to check the skin temperature so this probe and when you remove this okay this probe is to check the ear temperature inside the ear okay now how to check that i will show you when you put it there is a button here on top in this type there is a button here for all other types there will be some button everywhere uh, and uh, it will be written in that pamphlet that comes with the uh, thermometer so you just press this you will hear a sound okay the screen comes on can you see that l o low and you can see an ear on top uh, here you can see an ear on top that means this is a oral it is you can check the ear temperature presently in this now how do you check press put it in the ear hole inside the ear hole release you will get a peak sound okay the temperature is here okay 97.2 that's normal again i'll show you in my other ear so hold the thing hold the button put it in your thermo ear leave it that's it okay so there you can see hmm? now how do i check the ear now baby is small is not ready to allow you to put the thermometer in the ear then how do you put it in that case you have to change the mode now here you can see there is ear that means it is ear mode here there is a button of bl okay mode in a mode okay and set so the mode button you have to press it will change so it is showing one bottle that means it's surface thermometer you can use it to temp check the temperature of the milk that is being made that's why it is bottle okay and third can you see that's actually a forehead of a person you can see here it's actually a forehead of a person and the thermometer is being shown over there so now how you're going to is now i put it on the skin temperature i'm going to press this button and just see i'm not touching it to my forehead it's clear near the forehead i'm just moving it from side to side and side to side basically this temporal to that temporal okay and just leave it hmm? you see the thermometer okay once more i'll do press it start sensing from one temporal this area is called temporal temporal to the other and to again you can do it even once but it's okay once you release the button has to be kept pressed while you are checking once you release you get this temperature okay now there are many parents who like you know because the patient doesn't like on the forehead they even check on the back i really don't know how accurate it is on the back but ideally you're supposed to check on the forehead because there are arteries here temporal arteries which help which are pulsating and you know it's a uh, temp it's a warm area there that's why okay so this is about the infrared thermometer uh, there are different thermometers also like you know the you know nowadays with the new technology there are thermometers in the nipple itself so there but i don't know whether they are available in india then there are uh, strips so which are not that accurate so i usually do not uh, uh, advise strips to my patients here okay so today's the um, this video was only about the thermometer how to use it i hope it was useful okay i will put the link about uh, the thermometer changing the settings from degree celsius to degree fahrenheit as well as a link on the digital thermometers the infrared thermometers and the digital thermometers in the description box thank you and hope i do continue with the other series of the pediatric small problems okay